all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here. Day 27 on the frozen rock. And the last time, or in the last episode, we were working on getting a delivery system for our refineries. And so we got most all of the piping in. I got to finish that. One thing I discovered when I come back and looked at it, uh, if you remember, this was kind of laying down on the ground, and I'm not sure what happened, but it had exploded one piece of scrap off of there, and then the other, the elbow and the connector was laying down on the ground. So I've got to repair that again. I do have the <coughs> rotor set to share inertia, which it shouldn't have been a problem, but I've got it locked at uh, zero degrees, so uh, I was needed to do that anyway. So let me get rid of the scrap from that. And that's that. Will that go in there? No. Nope. That must uh, need to be done over at the other refinery. Let's see here. Yeah. Okay, that must be iron or something like that. Alright, so today I want to finish... Finish that piping there. Get that completely done, and then I can take all the scaffolding out. Although it does look kind of cool, but it needs to come out. And then I want to work on the truck upgrade. So if we go and look at the board, uh, that was kind of, I put that towards the top. We get the truck all upgraded, the cargo truck. Then we can start going after this lithium and look to see what if we can get to the titanium and the gold with an upgraded truck. So once I get this done, uh, I'll uh, catch back up with you and I can tell you what we're going to do moving forward. Okay, I am just finishing up the last of the piping here. There's that. Let's run down and weld the other two pieces from the bottom. There we go. So there's that T junction. And there we go. Green. I like green. Green's good. Okay, so we have all of the piping in for a good delivery system to our refineries. Now, the next thing we got to do is get the truck built. So, actually, first thing I'm going to do though is let's uh, take down all of this scaffolding. Come on, you're going to let me get that? All right, fine. We'll do it this way. All right, fine. We'll do it this way then. I just always worry that I'm going to cut something out from underneath me. All right. Like right there. I almost almost did it right there. Okay. All right. I think we will save that. Come down here. Uh, 
those. I think I'm going to leave those in. And we're going to come back up here and finish taking out these. Now you use cement blocks, which uh, the girders are cheaper than using a, a sheet of steel. So that's why I use the uh, girders. All right. There we go. That's good. Okay. There is all the scaffolding. So there we have a completed delivery system. Now let's hopefully I can get it to work properly. Uh, but that's for a little bit later. All right. Now down to the truck, the cargo truck. Let's, uh, unhook, unhook that, and let's kind of back it just a little bit away from the base, and, uh, let's take that off. Yeah, that should be good right there. All right. Let's go back inside. Do I have pistons set up? I do not. So let's do this. Let's uh, get into our control panel. Well, first off, let me see something here. Let's not get too carried away. So, what I need to do is lift this thing up. And I should be able to just take all four pistons and do that. And then we're going to have to grind these metal wheels off. And we want to put rubber wheels on. And I want to put three by three, I believe. Uh, I think those will work pretty good. I Hopefully, I got enough room to allow for that all the way across. So yeah, let's go ahead and put the wheels on. We'll do that first. So let's get this lifted up. Uh, get into our control panel here. Pistons. And let's just reverse them. think anything's happening. Uh, all right. Why was nothing happening? Control panel, pistons. Oh, that's why nothing was happening. Because they consume an awful lot of power. That, we're going to turn them off for right now. Okay. Now we should, yeah, I can still get in there. All right. All right, so that takes, that's got that up into the air. Let's just grind one of these guys off. right here. Oh, I still didn't finish. Yeah, we'll get to that. I'll finish that uh, end, the connector here after I get the truck upgraded. All right. So let's go to G and 
I want the three by three left. Right, yeah, left, right. So facing this away, uh, that will be my left side. So let's do that. And let's just pull that down. And we might as well pull the right down as well. Okay. So I need steel plates. Let's see what a 5x5 five five looks like. Dang it. Uh, let's go uh, G. in here. That's the metal wheel. That's what we're taking off. Three. Well, there's the five by five left. If I write. All right. Let's just see how this looks. Put that right there. there. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, I can never get these to line up the way I think they should. I think those are going to be just a little too big for this. I don't quite have... So we'll go with the 3x3s. Three so let's do this. Let's go G. Uh, the 3x3 three three right, 3x3 three three left. Let's drop that down there. I think those will be fine. The 3x3 three three left. Alright, so we need steel plates. Let's just get one of these on there. And what's the proper way for that to look? I think that's the way that sh should go. Yeah, there we go. Let's put that right there. Let's get to our welder. Let's see if we can weld this up. Small tubes. Hopefully, well, I hope that these are going to be better.
I just wondering. Let's because I want this to be able to go a, to a lot through a lot of places. I I honestly think that yeah we're gonna go with the three by threes. I think those are gonna be just fine. So let's. No, 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 now no sliding away. That, that is, that's uncool. That is just uncool. All right, let's go to two. And three is left. Let's see if we can get all the parts for that. Correct there. All right. All right. Uh, that's not cool, bro. Come on, what are you doing? All right. Let's do this. Do I have some steel? Just need one piece of steel. And we're just gonna make sure that you don't slide any further. All right, that should stop you if you start sliding again. All right, where am I at here? All right. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead and slide into that block. All right, let's uh, take these two off over here. Also means once we get these on that we're gonna have to uh, redo our wheels and all of that but that's okay all right control two this we want for right oh what the hell I know what's happening here. I've got a ton of stuff. Let's uh, get rid of some of this scrap. Just pitch it right here. And... Do we have... See if we can get both of these on here. Oh, uh, come on. That's here's one. There's two. All right. Back to the welder. parts that we're carrying. Now, let's, uh... Alright, let's get all of our parts. 
Okay. Probably going to regret not trying to go to 5x5, five five, but we'll see. All right. Well, there's four wheels replaced. It still is a higher suspension. If you're looking at it, that's still higher than, than these. So let's go ahead and grind these two off. Okay. All right. We'll get the parts for two more right wheels. Holy cow. Let's run this scrap over to the other one. It can be grinding away. There we go. Okay. Now, let's, uh, Right side. here. Okay. That one's done. Okay. Let's get our parts. Done. All right. There we go. That's wheels on this side. Okay, let's grind these off. Oh, crap. There we go. Okay, and let's go throw this scrap in over here. All right, I think I have steel on me, so I can go ahead and at least get these wheels set on here. Now we're back to the left side, so let's pop that on there, pop that on there. All right, let's see if we can get rid of some of this stuff. What the? Stop it! Why are you? I shouldn't, I shouldn't be able to do that, but apparently I, I can. All right. Oh, 
All right. Let's. Okay, let's go get our parts, get those wheels built, and then maybe we can get this thing set back down on the ground so that it's not low. going to roll away. And of course, energy is low. There's that one. There's that. There's that. That. All right. So the wheels have been upgraded. Let's, uh... Let's hop up here. Oh, come on. Hop. There we go. All right. And I can get recharged while I am looking at the control panel. So... Let's create a s left, 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 right, 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 all right. So if we do this, uh, cargo. Cargo wheels. Okay. And I think we just go with the defaults for now. And let's save that. Uh, okay. So let's, uh, okay. Let's, uh, hit the pistons. Let's turn them on. And let's reverse that. And one on off. Okay. Let's move that block out from back here. Actually glad I left those pistons on there. That was from the very beginning. All right. Let's take this out for a short little spin. Oh, I know one thing I got to do with those wheels. Otherwise, I'm going to get myself in trouble. Let's uh, get back into uh, into the cabin and control panel. Let's go to the wheels. I need to slow that speed down a little bit. Slow that down to somewhere around 80. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. There's that. All right. Now I wanted to put two more, actually four more batteries on here. So here's what we're going to do. Let's just park this right here, and let's get out of this. I have enough lithium. What am I doing? I need to pull this over here a little closer. All right, let's uh... holy cow. 
I need to slow this down just a bit more, but we will. Okay, put that on. All right, uh, let's hop out of here. All right, I'm gonna grind these batteries down for the lithium paste, because we got, there's no reason to have all of this scrap out here. Get this place cleaned up and looking good. And... I just ended up not needing... needing the actual batteries. And now that we found lithium, uh, hopefully I can put enough power on this rig. Okay. And let's get just get the batteries out of here. I think that's it. That was the parachute. All right, I'll come back and finish grinding that off. But let's get over here. And where are my these 14? Let's get that going first, because that's what I want. And we now are up to What was I building? Ooh. Okay, well, I need to go over here and get some lithium. Is it, this is where I built the... No. Uh, it was the advanced assembler? All right. Production. Let's get to Okay. It takes two power cells for each of the little batteries. Alright, let's see if we can get two more. Okay. That should be enough for four batteries, or for two batteries. I'd like to get four batteries built. So that means I need eight of these. Okay, let's see. Okay, good. There's four more batteries. And let's pull those over here. Uh, actually, let me throw the rest of that scrap in. All right. Ah, oh, a little bit of snow. Okay. All right, let's do this. Uh, two, one G, power, power blocks. I want this. Let's drop that down right there. Oh, I need steel plates, so let's do that. Let's get... Uh, okay. All right, 
one, two. Grab some steel plates. I thought I. All right. What's going on here? All right. Let's see. Maybe if I'd press the right buttons. All right. That's done. That's completed. battery yeah all right so cargo battery 10 okay cargo that it did collect all of them. Alright. Those are cargo batteries. Save. Okay. And let's go to... Just make for sure. Let's go groups. Cargo wheels. And we want that to recharge on and off. Okay. Looks like we need to get pulled over here, so let's. Uh, charged up. OK. 
Okay. Holy smokes. I know I've been recording pretty steady on this particular one, because I kind of figured you guys might have wanted to see the build a little bit. Uh, let's hop out of here. Let's get... Uh, That's that. So the only other thing I wanted to consider is putting a... I think I will. And then if I need to put more power on this thing, I will. Those wheels should be strong enough. I should be able to put another medium cargo box on here. So let's do this. Let's go G. Cargo boxes. And where's my medium? Uh, there it is. Let's pull that down. That where the battery was. And I need some aluminum plates. Let's see if we can get all the parts for this. Okay. there like that. That's actually going to be perfect, I think. All right, now let's go over here, G. Uh, oh, I actually already have it down here. Six. That needs steel plates. I already have, and I think that is how I want that. That is built. There's some things I'm going to want to do here. I'm going to want to put a camera, but for now, that's good for right now. Now, what I want to do is... I need to come back over here and finish fixing this again. So, I need a pipe. Uh, and I need one of those. So, let's come up here. Get that. And get that. And then six I need. Oh, come on. Dean Basic Computers. Come on, get those computers built. There we go. All right. Now we can finish getting this built. Put that there. Put that there. And six. That is exactly how I want that. Let's get these built. And then the other nice thing too is when this is hooked up to the base, it will charge. I don't have to connect it up through the, the tethers like I'm doing. So. Let's go grab this. Get it backed up there. Okay, that was up to 74%. 
All right. Let's back this out of here. Oh, I know what I got to do before I get too carried away. Uh, let's block that. Uh, control panel. Uh, actually, I need G. Uh, connector. Let's drop it down right here. And that's switch lock. There we go. All right. Whoa, boy, these wheels are something. smokes. hop out of here. I didn't... <laughs> Holy smoke. Well, that's okay, because I'll have other vehicles, I think. So this one pretty much lined up. So that is connected. So the next time I go and grab ores, all I got to do is back up to this thing. Although I still have to set that. So, I think... Yeah. 48 minutes, so it's time to call this a video. I know quite a bit of it was just uh, spent uh, upgrading the truck, but that's what I was planning on doing anyway. So we've got this all upgraded. It has the ability to connect up uh, so I can load up my cargo boxes. I got five of them on there now, five mediums. And it seems to have plenty of power without any load in there. Uh, but we'll see. It just going to be curious to see what the range is. Anyway, all right, all you space engineers out there. Keep building away. And uh, uh, I will uh, see you in the next video. All right. Well, with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.